And tonight, we watched the presidential debate with a group of students over at the University of Rochester. Abortion, immigration, and the economy are some of the issues they said they were hoping to hear the candidates discuss. How many of you are old enough to vote? And of those who are old enough, how many are registered? For most of these University of Rochester students, this will be their first presidential election. <laughs> Many watched the last debate and were hopeful for a better performance Tuesday night. It wasn't great for uh, the president. You know, um, he did drop out, um, I would say, probably because of that. I think that Donald Trump has composed himself and kind of restrained himself a little bit more than the last debate, which I think he really needed to do. Most admit they were watching for entertainment purposes or those gotcha moments. She's having so much fun right now. These students range in age and are actually members of the award-winning University of Rochester debate team, or union as it's called. Civic and um, policy, they both have one topic that they work through all year, so that's a lot of doing research, a lot of what we call cutting cards, uh, like creating these uh, arguments that you're going to use against different teams for the AF and the NEG, the for and the against. They'll be competing with students from Yale and Harvard and traveling to dozens of competitions this school year, one all the way in Panama. I asked them how this performance by Vice President Kamala Harris and former President Donald Trump compares to their debates and if they see anything that will be useful. I feel like if we did anything that they do like in these debates, like we would be like removed or something. Like. And in the end, like many other voters, these students say this debate did not change their views or how they plan to vote in November. We want to thank the University of Rochester for allowing us to hang out with yeah, them. Today. I'm glad you're able to get in there and yeah. mix it up with the students there.